Skills development is on government agenda and the Ministry of Education and Sports has set up infrastructure and policies to serve the beneficiaries. The Director of Basic and Secondary Education from the Ministry of Education and Sports, Ismail Mulindwa, says students completing the lower secondary curriculum will be employable. And we have moved some schools. And when I came to Nabingo here, I found Nabingo is now a model school because they seem to have understood the curriculum better than many other schools. And I want to encourage other schools which are still struggling. You can spare a minute uh, what, and go to Nabingo and try to see how the curriculum is being implemented. Uh, now we are confident when it comes to assessment in Senior 3, where the, children, the learners are supposed to get uh, their certificates, it will be easier for uh, such a school. The Directorate of Industrial Training is on a familiarization tour countrywide in secondary schools to sensitize and inspect the new curriculum set up. So we call upon all schools to make sure they prepare learners for assessment. I'm happy to, to, to see DIT going a step further, engaging the teachers, passing them through on the process of assessing these learners when it comes to the time of Assessment. The headmistress, Trinity College Nabingo, Rwanga Immaculate Nasozi, commends the new curriculum for being more practical and user friendly. She, however, calls on for additional financial support towards the vocational subjects. The other schools that have not got, got on board with the new curriculum should uh, rethink about the importance and the advantages that they are denying the children. This world, I think, needs us to address the problems we have uh, by coming up with, with workable solutions. And uh, it is helping the children to, to be creative. The Directorate of Industrial Training will assess and certify the competence of students next year in the eight pre-vocational subjects of agriculture, art and design, entrepreneurship, performing arts, nutrition and food technology, ICT, physical education, technology and design. As the Directorate of Industrial Training, uh, we are ready to assess the senior three candidates in 2023, that is by November. 2023. We have already worked on the roadmap. Registration of secondary schools is ongoing. We are about to reach 2,000 secondary schools. If the entire centers under UNEB, there are 3,500. So we have at least reached a better number. Each student will sit for only one occupation according to his competency and convenience. We're going to use non-biodegradable materials like bottles, caveras, so that you can reduce on the plastics. According to this project, it can be sold during the holidays and you get more money. And even this can be used at home as a table mat, for it looks very nice. Sudat Kaye and Henry Muganga, UBC News.